Hi friends, these are my top 5 tips to grow lettuce successfully in aero garden or any hydroponic system. Tip number 1. Pick the right variety. Most lettuce varieties do fine in many hydroponic systems. However, few varieties do much better in terms of yield, taste and longevity. Lola Rosa and Paris Island Cos are my favorites. Lola Rosa is a leaf lettuce looks beautiful with a nice color gradient and it lives for 3 to 4 months. It takes only 3 weeks from seed to first harvest. Paris Island Cos Lettuce is a romaine variety, produces wide and dark green leaves and it lives for more than 4 months if you take good care of it. By good care, I mean we just have to change the water clean the bowl and start over with fresh water and nutrition every 8 to 10 weeks. If you could change water every 6 to 8 weeks, that will be even better. Tip number 2. Pick the right hydroponic system. As I said earlier, most lettuce varieties do fine in many hydroponic systems for the initial growth. However, longevity is the big question. If the lettuce doesn't get enough light, it gets leggy and bolt really fast. Too much light is also an issue. If it gets too much light, issue is same and plants get bolt really fast. I got pretty good results in many hydroponic systems. However, I had lot more success in Aero Garden Harvest. Aero Garden Harvest has 20 voltage lights and that seems to be right for pretty much any lettuce variety. Tip number 3. Keep the garden at a right temperature. Lettuce gets tip burns at high temperature. High temperature also makes the lettuce go to bolt really fast. And low temperatures will slow down the growth of the plants. I found that the ideal temperature to grow lettuce is between 55 and 65 degrees Fahrenheit. This is the reason I move all my lettuce gardens to my garage as soon as the plants are well established which is normally after 3 to 4 weeks. In case you don't have access to keep the gardens at low temperatures, then we have two options. The first option is run a small fan that covers all the plants. It is up to you whether you want to run it for a couple of hours a day or run it 24 by 7. Anything works. The second option is to add a few ice cubes into the bowl every day. Tip number 4. Limit the number of plants to only one plant per pod. We can manage multiple plants per pod, but that turns into lot of complications really fast. Plants grow weak, leggy and leaves are wilted. Multiple plants per pod also makes the harvesting very difficult as there won't be much space to run the hands, fingers or knife. Tip number 5 is the harvesting method. Always harvest only outer leaves so that the plants will continue to produce more lettuce. We don't waste any part of the lettuce in this harvesting method. There are other harvesting methods such as harvesting the entire head at once. I never saw lettuce forming a nice head in any of my hydroponic systems. Even if you see a nice head, don't harvest the whole head unless you have a real reason for it. If we harvest the whole head, that's pretty much the end of the life. Plants may shoot out the side growth, but that doesn't last long. The other harvesting method is called haircut. Lot of lettuce gets wasted in this method and plants will also take lot of time to make more lettuce. That's why I prefer outer leaf harvest over other harvesting methods. Those are my top 5 tips. Just wanted to mention one last thing that is nutrients. I have tried both aerogarden nutrients and maxi grow nutrients and both turned out very well and lettuce is same in taste. Just because maxi grow nutrients are economical, I prefer to use maxi grow over aero garden nutrients. That's pretty much. Please let me know if you have any more tips so that we all can benefit from each other. Thanks for watching and happy aero gardening.